Hello YouTube! Uh, today is day two of Book Tubeathon, and I thought I'd do a little reading update as well as the video challenge, which not all video challenges speak to you, and today was to recreate a landscape from one of your books, which maybe just based on the books I'm reading, I didn't have one that really excited me. So uh, yesterday I read uh, The Missing Piece by Shel Silverstein, and so I recreated that landscape on this piece of paper, which I think it's a very good rendering, personally. I've been, I've read four books, or started at least four books, finished one, so I finished The Missing Piece. Um, also, last night after dark, I started reading Seattle Market Ghost Stories, um, which really is just the introduction, basically. Um, I've been reading Monstrous Regiment, uh, which I'm liking. Uh, and reminds me a lot of Mulan, and uh, it's possible that I am now inferring a romantic storyline that doesn't exist because I'm trying to make it more like Mulan. I'm also on audiobook reading uh, Landline by Rainbow Rowell. My friend Christina reviewed it on her channel, and I put it on my TBR, and then completely forgot everything about it. Just don't remember anything whatsoever. Uh, but I knew it was something I discovered through BookTube, and I knew that at some point I liked it enough to put it on my list of books to read, and so I decided uh, not to try to find out why I liked it. So I'm approaching this book not knowing anything about it. Um, like, I haven't, I got this copy from the library in case I want to switch from the audiobook to the physical book, but I haven't even, like, read the stuff on the back. I'm just, like, I didn't read anything, which, uh, this is a great book, I think, to approach that way, because... It starts out really mundane, and then right around chapter three, starts to get very weird. And at that point, I was like, oh, this must be why I wanted to read this book. So I'm also about a fourth of the way through this book. And that thing happened where I got an idea of how maybe, like, maybe where the book is going. I got this notion of how it might end and sort of the moral of the story and where it's all heading. And I'm really hoping I'm wrong, because if I'm right then the rest of the book is going to be really predictable. So I'm hoping that I have guessed this incorrectly and that I don't know where it's going because um, I'm really worried that the thing that I think is going to happen happens and I have to spend the next three quarters of a book just watching it happen. Uh, so that's my reading update. I'm going to read some more of Landline or listen to Landline on audiobook today. I'm going to read some more of Monsters Regiment. Uh, I might start on screw tape letters just to change things up. Who knows? Uh, check out the Instagram challenges as well. Check out the Booktubeathon channel if you want more details on the rules. And I'll see you guys later. Bye!